Good morning, New London. Welcome to the Morning Minute for Friday, July 21st. Taking a quick look at the weather, the National Weather Service says it'll be partly sunny today with a high near 75. Partly cloudy tonight with a low around 58. Saturday looks like sunny conditions with a high near 80 with some scattered showers and thunderstorms after 2 p.m. In sports, the Guardians had the day off yesterday and will host the Philadelphia Phillies in Cleveland this evening. Looking back on this date in history, on this day in 1861, a dry summer Sunday, Union and Confederate troops clashed outside Manassas, Virginia in the first major engagement of the Civil War, the first battle of Bull Run. In 1954, the Geneva Accords for Indochina were signed, dividing the French colonial territories into the countries of the Democratic Republic of Vietnam, the State of Vietnam, Cambodia, and Laos. We know how well that worked out. In 1996, The Daily Show, a late-night talk and satirical news program, premiered on Comedy Central. 2002, WorldCom Inc. filed for bankruptcy protection after disclosing it had inflated profits by nearly $4 billion through deceptive accounting practices. And in 2007, Harry Potter and the Deadly Hollows, the final book in J.K. Rowling's Harry Potter series, was released. For those with birthdays today, you share it with Jean Picard, French astronomer, born on this date in 1620, Paul Julius Baron von Reuter, German-born founder of Reuter's News Service, born in 1816, American actor Don Knotts, born in 1924, and comedian actor Robin Williams, born in 1951. Looking at today's events in the area, it's all about motorsports. The Pontiac Nationals will be at Summit Motorsports Park 8 to 11 this evening. And the 2023 AMA Vintage Motorcycle Days, featuring racing, entertainment, and one of America's largest motorcycle swap meets, and more takes place at the Mid-Ohio Sports Car Course in Lexington. That's the morning update for Friday, July 21st. Thanks for watching, and everyone have a great day.